A total of 21,241 illegal immigrants have been deported since January this year. A majority of them are Indonesians, followed by Bangladeshis and Myanmar nationals. According to Home Minister Tato Sri Hamza Zainuddin, there are still around 15,000 people in the country's immigration depots waiting to be sent back to their respective homeland. But the COVID-19 pandemic has made deportation exercises rather tough. Actually, it is quite tough at the moment for us to send them back. Uh, one, because they themselves uh, are not ready to receive uh, their own people uh, coming back from Malaysia. Uh, I don't understand this because uh, at, uh, at the moment our position uh, combating uh, COVID-19 is actually uh, much better than some of those countries. Uh, but they believe, uh, um, you know, the strain, if if uh, the possibility of bringing the strain and whatever that they have there, it could be another problem. So that's the reason that we are actually making sure the understanding of the two countries to accept and for us to send them back. Hamza spoke to reporters after attending the Immigration Excellence Service Awards. At the event, he also launched the new Immigration Department's norm, which is the delivery of upgraded services with the use of digital and online applications with the theme, Deal with the Machine.